What is up guys and welcome back to another episode of Wisco Angling. Today I'm going on a paddle boat, fishing out of a paddle boat with one of my buddies going bluegill fishing here. I haven't fished out of a paddle boat in I don't even know how long. It's been forever but it, it's fun so that's what we're doing. I don't know why uh, I'm saying it like that. I already went fishing. We already I already made this video. Weird order of events here but we did catch fish. We did a catch and cook after we caught the gills in the paddle boat. We went to my buddy's private pond and we cooked them up there on a dock that he's got out there. So yeah, it was very yummy, very fun. So stay tuned, because that is what we do in this video. Hooked up to a nice gill in the old paddle boat. <laughs> this feels like an actual decent gill. Oh yeah. yeah. Nice male, nice thick man. Ooh, oh. A little bit of cabbage on <laughs> lifted the rod tip up, and now we're now we're screwed. <laughs> Should, guy. Should we keep him to eat? Yeah, why not? Probably. Get the male. Set the camera up. Yep, there he is. Wow. Fish on. That's another. That's another nice gill, dude. Another nice gill. Okay, I'm gonna cast again. Yeah. Yeah. Give me a warning next time. I'll keep my rod tip down. <laughs> Just like another. Probably another male. There he goes. Yep, nice. Double up. Oh god, he's digging. Ah, that is not even that big. Cutter, huh? Ow! Well, we're gonna do it. Yeah, he's like purple. This one's pissing all over me. Is it big enough to keep up? That's it. I don't know. I mean, you know we, you know where we are. We'll get bigger. So I don't really want to. We're doing a catch and cook today, guys. A little catch and cook. Get a couple nice gills for a catch and cook. I might. Right where that first one hit, and I got that second one right there, too. Yep, there he is. Yep, fish on. <laughs> hey, it's hauling over there. Why are they like that weird cookie cutter size right now? Not a fan. God, they're pissing so much. Come on, take it. Oh, 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 oh. Got him. Ooh. Feels decent. Not huge, but. Pulls a paddle ball everywhere. Right. Oh, he's got a he's got a little salad with him. That's why he ain't too bad. But we'll get bigger. Next year's keeper. If he makes it past ice season. Right. Yep. Fish, 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 fish. Get him. Got him. Yep. Uh, wow, this oh. one. This is the smallest one so far, I think. Okay. Well, now he's starting to pull, but this is fun out of the old little paddle boat, dude. Smallest one for me so far. Oh, right behind us, something blew up yeah. there. Could have been the snapper. Actually, probably was. He's probably following us right now. He's probably staring at that fish basket. Nothing better, man. A little slip bobber rig. One inch, one inch gulp minnow. Yeah. Getting her done. Watch this. Probably be instant again. Right up in the oh, shallows. Already. Yep, already. As soon as the freaking thing settles down, Bobber stands up, it's going down. Come on, take it again. Oh, I saw that. I wasn't paying attention, I was looking at you. Come on, yeah. Nah, that should be instant right there. Instant, dude. It's too easy. It feels better, too. This feels like one of them eight, eight and a half. We should have brought a bump board out here. Oh. Boy. That ain't bad. Yeah, I mean, for catch and cook standards, you know, I think that would work. Is that a turtle right there, or is that just like a snail sitting there? It's got to be a snail, because that's really close and it's still up. Alright, of course, I wasn't recording for this, but I just caught a freaking Mondo. Ah! Uh -oh, my Look at that deal there. 
It's a nice, what would you say, Jordan? Pushing like eight and three quarters, probably maybe even nine. Closer to nine, maybe. Nice, nice. Pulling super hard right away, and now it's. Yeah, nice right watch. Bass? Oh, that's a go. It might be a female. Is it? it might be. It looked pretty, uh. Yep. Whoa. <laughs> Just wow, dude. Yeah. Just wow. Holy crap. So he slaunched. Oh, slaunched donkey there. Oh, heck yeah. Oh. Uh, Boom, boom. Come on, take it again, man. You think you can get this out? Cause I can't. Hold I on, hold on. I'm getting a uh, getting fishy bit. What's going on over there, guy? Just a little ass man. A little bit of some more double up action. You got a female. Mine's just pulling hard. I don't know if it's it's got to be stuck in something unless it's like really big. Track. It might be a big one. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh, oh yeah! Oh yeah! Damn. That's a mondo, dude. That's like a pound and a half bluegill. Look, it's all effed up, dude. It's got its spine showing up top. Is it? It's whack. Oh yeah, dude. That thing just looks like dead weight. You got it's another like, on my. Fighting like a female. It is fighting like a big female. It's a nice one. I might be, that's a male, yeah, though. That's a male, yeah. Ain't hey, even that might, big. He might be up guarding the bed. Yeah. There. How many do we got, though? I don't want to... I don't want to... We've got five. Can we do a five? I think that's enough for a catch and cook, eh? Yeah. Let these guys go. Bang, bang. I think I might have another molly on. This is perfect when they pull us like this, kind of get us back up. up. Double up. Nice. <laughs> oh, he's getting in that weeds, though. Oh my gosh, it's just a, it's a short, fat female. Yep. Yeah, just a short, fat female there. Is it pretty good? Lake number two on the search for some more keepers for a catch and cook. It feels solid, but it's stuck oh. in some grass too, but it's definitely it is pretty. Yeah. Looks decent? I can't tell you. Oh, that's nice. That's an eater too. Is that a male or female? It's a male. Oh yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, that's a good that's a good gill right there to eat. <laughs> oh he's pissing all over me. You love it, huh? Love pissing on you. Just make loving it or what? Bait up here and get him in the Nice gill right there and throw in the Look at that forehead though. Look at it. Oh did you hear that? He's talking, you see? He said eat me, dude. <laughs> Alright, fine. Three what should we do? Three good eater males. We should do like eight. Depends on how hungry you are. I'm hungry. But we got we got all the time. Like when we go back, you know, yeah. we can cook. I mean, oh, there you go. Come on, come on. God, I had him pinned a little bit there. Ouch. Got him again. Oh my gosh, yeah. another hog, eh? No, he's not a hog. But... Hooks at me. It's, it's a nice keeper. I'd say. <laughs> I'd say he says, get her done. Ow, oh, dude, my upper back hurts. It's like doing that thing where when I put my neck down. I almost lost them. <laughs> Have a good catch and cook tonight, eh? Tell Dylan to come up. He definitely won't. One. Wow, immediately. Immediately. We have four. I got another keeper here. Is it? Big, big gill, dude. Neck. Just a bowl. In the net? I hope you not. Are you rolling? Yes, sir. <laughs> big, oh, dude, that's nice. Big bowl, dude. Just a huge bowl. Nothing like ginormous. Just a bowl, dude. Look at that fish. <laughs> not huge, but man, they're good. They're spawn beds out there. Perfect right? eater, man. Perfect eater. Let's go. Hey, it wrapped up. It's a nice one, dude. Oh, God, yeah. Eight and a half, nine. All day. Look at that. Yes, sir. Here, let me see that quick. What the? He's long, dude. Oh, there's mine. Oh, my gosh. Big? Oh, my <laughs> gosh, dude. Oh, Lord. This is fun. What's better than actually catching these big spawning gills, though? I mean, come on. I ain't going to keep a ton of them because I don't want to. No, we'll actually let we'll let this one go here. This one's not too big. Very healthy, though. I don't want to. Very healthy and pretty fish right there. I don't want to ruin any 
popping the uh, probably bass. Huh? I'm thinking a bass, yeah. I don't really want to try and cast too far over there though with that tree there. Yeah. Get it right there. There's definitely bee flying right over my head right now. I hear it. Going zoom zoom zoom, he says. He says, I'm gonna stay in here. Right? So if it's not too shallow in there, there might even be some beds back in there, so we'll get through. Oh, I'm, you're getting taken. Something's going on here, right? Maybe it's because we were floating back. Yeah. We gotta stay out fishing here for a while, but I'm also starving, so. Oh, there you go. That was a fish. Come on. Poop. Ooh. Hmm? There's stuff getting blown up on the top of these. Only dragonflies and stuff. Yeah. All right, guys, with my buddy Jordan, just got back from the lake. We're at his private pond here, cooking up these fish, chilling out here, shooting some pew pews. <laughs> <laughs> I almost said it. So, yeah, got that fish going. It's going to be nice. We're hungry as heck. We've been fishing all morning. Got a handful of gills that we're cooking up, so, heck yeah. Got the fish done there, just a little pot of them. Our makeshift plate, because hmm. Jordan forgot a plate. Whoops. <laughs> Mound down. Got a little gill thin and crispy. Mmm. Mmm. Yummy. That's pretty good. We got mm -hmm. the Shore Lunch original stuff. Mm -hmm. That's pretty good. Can't go wrong with Shore Lunch, though. So. Mm -hmm. Thumbs up to that. Alrighty guys, thanks for watching here. That's gonna do it for this video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that little catch and cook, little fishing out of the paddle boat, just some quick stuff there. And uh, yeah, it was fun for me, it tasted good. Um, so yeah, that's it, I'm at this new spot here. I've actually never fished before. I'm about to film what I'm assuming will be the video posted after this one. So yeah, stay tuned to the channel. Hopefully I can go and catch some bass here, so yeah.